south of the valley, and now we know their names tonight. The pilot identified as 61 year old Jeffrey Pino from Chandler, the passenger, 72 year old Nick Tramontano. ABC 15's Lauren Vargas learning more about that passenger today. Lauren, we're told that he's originally from Connecticut. That's right, Kim. I just spoke with a woman who had interviewed Nick for her book on aviation mysteries, and she was so saddened to hear that he'll never get a chance to read it. Nick Tramontano was not only a pilot and an air, uh, airline pilot for many, many years, he was also a mechanic, and his uh, experience is very, very deep in both the mechanics and the operation of flights. Christine Negroni says she featured Tramontano in her book, The Crash Detectives, because he was extremely familiar with an old airliner she was writing about. Negroni says he was very passionate about aviation and safety. They met at the airport in Connecticut last fall, where he worked on his restored aircraft, and she noticed he had also befriended a young boy who also wanted to be a pilot someday. Everyone I know who knew Nick, you know, raved about his level of expertise, his affection for flying, his passion for safety. So it's, you know, heartbreaking to all of us in Connecticut that, that, he's, uh, that he's gone. It's still unclear why Tremontano was in Arizona yesterday, but the Pinal County Sheriff's Office says he was the passenger in a World War II era plane that crashed and burned near Maricopa. The NTSB and the FAA are now investigating that crash. Kim. Yeah, just really sad, but really different to get to hear the background of how he got there. Thanks so much, Lauren.